Hello everyone and welcome back to my let's play of Mass Effect 2. We are continuing on from our cliffhanger with the collector's landing. Mort, you sure these armor upgrades will protect us from the seeker swarms? I hope so. Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers, should confused detection make us invisible to swarms? In theory. In theory? Experimental technology. Only test is contact with seeker swarms. Have to test them in person. Should be exciting. Oh <laughs> god. Anyway, if you're new to the channel, make sure you like this, comment, and subscribe this. But we'll move on from that. <laughs> Hope everyone's been enjoying watching these. Me go down a trip down memory lane, I guess. Oh, okay, fight the collectors. Oh. Burn through any armor. Can't target them. Why can't? What happened? Now let's finish you off. I like the shotgun. This is nice. Right. I don't think there's anything around here. Mm, data pad. Ah, uh, there. Got her man, we hacked it. Oh, let's keep going. I'm guessing it's working if we're not getting hit by this. We'll activate those as well. Collector ship disrupting communications. We're on our own now. Oh, look, they're taking one of those <laughs> things. Heavy <weapon. laughs> <laughs> Oh man, I'm not a good shot today. Those things look like the husks the Geth used on Eden Prime. The Geth got that technology from Sovereign. Elusive Man was right. Collectors working with Reapers. Yeah, that's a given at this point. Thousand credits, man, it just gives us money, this game. You don't even need to try. He likes the uh, running head bobby thing. <laughs> I think when I first watched a playthrough of this when I was much, much younger, um, after I finished my playthrough, the head bobby thing is what Husks have human gave me motion sickness. Repurposed colonists. No. On Eden Prime, victims were turned into husks by impaling them on spikes. We haven't seen any. The collectors must have brought the husks. They're taking the colonists alive for something else. The collectors must be experimenting on the colonists. What are they up to? Speculation will get us nowhere. It could be anything. Find out for sure when you stop them. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced. Evolved. They can still be killed. They can be. Not wrong about that. The collectors aren't getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Move out. Yes, go, sir. go, go. That's my leg. Ouch. Just like freedom's progress. The entire colony gone. <laughs> Enemies in front. Taking heavy fire. Here we go. <clears throat> Ooh, shit. Yeah, just have a chill there, mate. You're right. Yeah. 
<laughs> Look at him. You all right there, mate? Having a good time? Yep. <laughs> Where's this last one? Oh. Let's change it over. Beat me. You guys take care of it. I'm going to have a quick look in here. Man, I'm struggling right now. We just had a big day of streaming. We did like nine hours or something today, so I'm a bit cooked. We'll keep going. Went for a run on the treadmill and then here we are now. How'd you just go? You kill him? Good job. Good job, you two. Yeah, we were out playing uh, Outward today, which was really cool. Well, I don't know if we got any progress on that, though. <laughs> Not much at all, I don't think. Um, which way are we going? What? So I guess. So we go this way? Oh yeah, yeah. Ooh, what is that? Victim appears conscious, fully aware, trapped in stasis. Fascinating. They've been like this a long time. Getting a bit quicker. Good. Brain starting to wake back up. Collectors are so gross. Gross. Big bug men. Oh, this is a battle and a half here. Collector's particle beam acquired. The following swarm of them is now not able to use this weapon. Oh, cool. Zzz. Yeah, I thought this would be a bit of a battle. This thing is overpowered. Now let's finish you off. Jesus, man. Oh, it just takes you. <laughs> OP is this thing? Zzz. Laser beam. Okay. Only so many combinations, I guess, of that as well.
company. Get out here, now. You're... you're human. What are you doing out here? You lead them right here. You had to hear them try to get in. Come on, survive. Seems like it's hard to hide from the collectors. Those things are collectors? You mean, they're real? I thought they were just made up, you know, propaganda to keep us in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. You? What's your name? What do you do here? Name's Delan. Mechanic. I came down to check on the main grid after we lost our comm signals. And I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of bugs. Everyone they touched just froze. I, I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed that Chief Williams here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. Hmm. Tell me more about this Alliance rep. Chief Williams? Heard she was some kind of hero or something. Didn't mean nothing to me, though. Would have rather she just stayed back in council space. Any idea what she was doing on Horizon? Supposed to be helping us get the defense towers up and running. I got the feeling she was here for something else. Spying on us, maybe. Tell me about the Colony Defense Towers. A gift from the Alliance. High-powered Guardian lasers. Supposed to keep hostile ships from landing near the colony. Had to build a massive underground generator just to give it enough juice. Only we couldn't get the targeting systems online. So the Alliance gave us a giant gun that couldn't shoot straight. Stupid sons of bitches. Hmm. Why do you think this is the Alliance's fault? We're just a small colony. Nobody bothered us before we started building those damn defense towers and drew attention to ourselves. I left Council Space to get away from the Alliance. Nothing good ever comes from getting mixed up with them. Eh, yeah, he's sort of got a point there. The Collectors are targeting remote colonies. The Alliance was trying to help. I don't need their help. Too many strings attached. That rep said she was just here to get the towers online, but mark my words, there's more to it. Hmm. If you have defenses, we can use them against the Collector's ship. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. We can figure it out. Just tell us where to find it. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. It's probably just better if you stay out of the way. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. Fair Good enough. luck. I think you're gonna need it. Huh. Let's go, go, go. Looks like a big area. Oh, anything Incoming. handy? Nope. Oh. to All right, something to look out for. It sucks too because the collectors don't actually drop any ammo. Unless it's heavy stuff. God that freaked me out. Big boom. I'll take it. I expected to run across more paralyzed colonists in this area. Colonists loaded onto ship. Collectors nearly finished here. Need to hurry. Let's check upstairs first. Hmm. 
Okay. Oh, hammer. Need that. Or not. Yeah, that fucking bobbing. That's my head in, eh? I don't know why I've only just noticed it. Oh. There we go. Good stuff. Yeah, this looks like a giant boss battle. So close. Take out their feet pretty easy. There's the transmitter. Oh man. This thing shields are so heavy. Have a look around. Mm, be nothing this way. Is there a door up there? Yep. Oh no, you can't get in. Oh, health. This just looks like a giant boss arena. There's something coming. Holy crap, look at that thing. My eyes were adjusting badly there, but we got it. Normandy, do you copy? Joker here. Signal's weak, Commander, but we got you. Edie, can you get the colony's defense towers online? Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. Collectors will respond with force to stop it. Got any other helpful tips? Just one. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. Thank you. Oh, if it's just them, I've got it. Watch out! Direct this personally. You cannot resist. I'm attempting emergency power up. Please hold the defense tower. You cannot resist. Oh, shit. The dead are useless. Okay, doing good, doing good. Doubtful that enemy has withdrawn. Reinforcements likely. Mm hmm. But the collectors did drop something. There they are. Sequential power up initiated. Guardian anti ship. Batteries at 40%. Reinforcements. Guess we got their attention. <laughs> Just burn nicely. Attack. Will not stop me. Continue. I know you feel this. My attacks will tear you apart. Part Shepard, I will. Take 
do the trick. One down. Yeah, we're getting better at this. Good, good. Risky business though, getting that close. Get ready. There's got to be more. I bet you there is. Oh, boss time. Oh god, what is that? Jesus, that is horrifying. Edie, we need that system online. He's dead. Good stuff. I'm starting to get way better at this combat. Get away! There's nothing we can do. They're gone. Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something! I didn't want it to end this way. I did what I could. Nobody could have done more, Shepard. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard, captain of the Normandy. Yeah, did you get free? Inspector. Savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a god, Delan. Back from the dead. Oh, the good people we lost and you get left behind. Figures. Screw this. I'm done with you Alliance types. I thought you were dead, Commander. We all did. Good to see you, mate. It's been too long, Ash. How have you been? That's it? You show up after two years and act like nothing's happened? I would have followed you anywhere, Commander. I thought you were gone. I... You were more than our Commander. Why didn't you try to contact me? Why didn't you let me know you were alive? Not my choice. I spent the last two years in some kind of coma while Cerberus rebuilt me. You're with Cerberus now? I can't believe the reports were right. Reports? So much for security. Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. I got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. I went to Anderson, but he wouldn't talk. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working for the enemy. Cerberus and I want the same thing, to save our colonies. That doesn't mean I answer to them. Do you really believe that? Or is that just what Cerberus wants you to think? I wanted to believe that you were alive. I just never expected anything like this. Oh, cry me a river, mate. You've turned your back on everything we stood for. I don't think so. Ash, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. What did they do to you? What if they're behind it? What if they're the ones working with the Collectors? 
Typical Alliance attitude. You're so focused on Cerberus that you're blind to the real threat. Yeah, you're too emotional, Ash. You're letting how you feel about their history get in the way of facts. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe it's you. Doesn't matter. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. It's in my blood. I'm reporting back to the Citadel. I'll let them decide if they believe your story. So long, Ash. So long, Commander. Good luck. Jeez, I guess. Way too emotional. Holy crap. Joker, send the shuttle to pick us up. I've had enough of this colony. Yeah, we did nothing wrong. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Cerberus did, though. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully the Collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. It was our first strike. How do we find them next time? The Collectors will be more careful now. But I think we can find another way to lure them in. Another way? Ash said the Alliance got a tip about me and Cerberus. Was that you? I may have let it slip that you were alive. And with Cerberus. You risked the lives of my friend, my crew, and that entire colony? Just to lure the Collectors there? A calculated risk. I suspected the Collectors were looking for you, or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. I told you I wouldn't sit and wait while the Reapers and Collectors gather strength. Besides, they would have hit another colony eventually, and without a way to predict which one, they would have abducted everyone. What's our next step? We have to keep the pressure on the Collectors. He's got a They'll point, be more cautious with their ground operations, so we need another opening. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong. As will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you put your past relationships behind you? It was hard to see Ashley again. And now it's done. Best to leave those connections behind and focus on our mission. Shepard, once you find a way through the Omega-4 relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. Let me worry about them. You just find us a way to the Collector homeworld. I just want to be upfront about your odds. You'll need everyone at their best. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. And be careful, Shepard. The Collectors will be watching you. Fair enough. I guess we're really gonna do it. Hit the Omega-4 relay. Take the fight to the Collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though, makes you think. Yeah, They're powerful, but we've got a few tricks for them. If anyone can stop them, we can. No argument there, Commander. Horizon just made it hit home. What we're doing, what we're up against. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? So yeah, pretty much we've got to do all of the unfinished business for people. Which is fine. Help them all as much as humanly possible. Uh, let's have a look and see if we've got any extra heavy weave. Yes, please. Yeah, we can allocate, reallocate stuff. Body damage, yes please. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Perhaps later. Trying to determine how scale itch got onto Normandy. Sexually transmitted disease only carried by Varen. Implications unpleasant. Anything else? I'll let you... Gross. We'll so be here if you need me. Rude to Varen? Yeah. Commander, sorry I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. 
Always have time for my crew. What is it? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it turns out to be a goose chase. But... Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. I'm listening. My private log got an update about the Hugo Gerns back. The ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week, reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing ten years ago. I hadn't talked to my father for three years before that. I've buried everything but a body. Now, I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. I think you'd be more excited that your father might be alive. He wasn't around enough for me to have bad memories. It's an old, well-healed wound. But if he's actually alive and needs help, I also want to note that it's not normal procedure for distress calls to be routed to the Normandy. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. Any signs that this was a Cerberus front? Who passed this to you? I doubt the elusive man would let a direct operation stake hold this long. If there's a link, it's probably just about money. Cerberus needs diverse holdings to fund projects like, well, you. And whoever sent this my way covered their tracks. Someone could be fishing for favors, or thought it would get under my skin. Who knows with that bunch? Fair enough. Is it like... No, I'm not gonna say that. You didn't get along with your father? He made no apologies, I'll give him that. You make a mistake, you own up to it. Even if you keep making it. Whatever problems we had were a lifetime ago. I've had ten years to get to where I am. And as far as I know, he's still a ghost. Tell me about the Hugo Gernsback and what it was doing. Privately held frigate. I looked over the mission brief when it disappeared. Nothing stood out. Typical research and grab operation. Find an uncharted planet, stake a claim, and establish as large a presence as you can, as fast as possible, to shut out competitors. Fair enough. I think we can spare the time. Yeah, Ask we'll the do that. Ask to Joker. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect more than dusty old bones, but it'll be good to close the record. Will be. Yeah, the thing I was gonna say, I don't know if it's racist or not. Like, Commander, you received a new message at your private terminal. Right. Um, an African American's father disappearing on him is like a tropey thing, isn't it? How is that not like seen as a bad thing to do there? Shepard, just checking in, making sure you're acclimatizing. The hold is too open. Not enough cover. Armor is limited. Warlord Granth would target here to scatter heavy cargo, then focus on engines. That's what tank imprints show about human ships anyway. It's how I learned from the tank. Old pictures where memory is. Like holding a book for a child. Just remember this picture after picture. No help with finding a reason to care. What other human info was floating around in there? Less than a finger deep to sever your spine. You're soft. Salarian, Sasari, all soft. Quarians, not so much. Turians, you have to work the blade, I guess. Don't see much point to it, though. <laughs> much point. <laughs> uh, never mind. At least he's got a sense of humor. <laughs> Something must move you. You're as genetically Krogan as you can get. I see suffering, the dead, and I think weak. I'm supposed to be strong. My guts were grown from thousands more worthy. The dead were weak. If they were strong, I wouldn't be needed. I don't know why Okir started teaching. When he turned on the tank the first time, I screamed. Weak. Pitiful. So you started small, but you became what you are. Not everyone gets that chance. I'm built for strength, but didn't earn it. I just am. Those dead were strong enough to try, even if they lost. The perfect Krogan, ignoring what made me. No strength in that. I'll take another look at what happened to the Krogan. Find a reason to care about it. Fair enough. Yeah, that trope just doesn't sit right with me, I guess. 
That's why I'm dying it. I just heard the collectors hit the Ferris Fields colony. Everyone's gone. Shit! We're going to make those dirty buggers pay. Dirty buggers pay. You got anything to say, Jack? Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. What are you up to? Still checking out your ship. Wouldn't mind putting her through her paces when you're not around. I doubt Joker would appreciate that. At least not while we're working. Relax. Joyriding doesn't have the thrill it used to. Besides, if I wanted it, I'd take it. That's so? I've been around. Ran with gangs, wiped out some gangs, joined a cult. Kept the haircut. I learned how to survive and not be a victim. It's hard to imagine you in a cult. That usually involves a lot of rules. I was looking for answers. Drugs and sex and going to a better place. A better place, right. It was all about money. They wanted to take a colony, shake the suckers down to fund their spread, and guess who was their ace in the hole? They were just like the rest. Didn't give one shit about me. What did you do when you found out? What do you think? Killed them all. <laughs> you must have met some good people, too. Everybody wants something. And because of that, everything is fair game. Murder, assault, kidnapping, drugs, stealing, arson. Done it all. And that's the boring shit. Piracy, theft of military craft, destruction of a space station, and vandalism. That was a good one. Military's a hard target. Bet that made you some friends. Shouldn't have left the thing unlocked. Besides, parades are boring. I helped. <laughs> a space station. You're pushing what I can believe. Ain't saying it was easy. Not everything is spur of the moment. Sometimes you gotta work to give people what they deserve. Had some people I hung with for a while. Outlaw colony. Felt like they were like me. Guess that made us a nice target. Turians think they know something about a scorched earth response. Fuck them. Mm -hmm. Hello? You were a pirate too? Ties in with the kidnapping. If you hijack a passenger ship and don't kill everyone, anyway. Good lesson. Simpler to just kill them all. I'm surprised you'd even mention vandalism at that bunch. That's what the Hanar call it when you crash that space station I mentioned into one of their moons and make a new crater. They really liked that moon. Do you ever wonder if you could have done things differently? No. Shouldn't you? There's no reason I should be alive, but I am. You know why? Instinct. It's worked for me so far, and I'm not gonna change. Hey, Shepard. No one's ever asked me about this shit. It's strange to talk about. So fuck you. And thanks for asking. Hello. Fuck you too. Um, yeah, she's fucking crazy. Yeah. Understandable why. Very sort of understandable why she's a psycho. Have you got anything to say, mate? This mission takes me back. Oh, does it? Tough fight on Horizon. I fought slavers and kidnapping rings, but nothing like that. Some slavers took a little girl on a colony in the Skepsis system. Girl woke up, fought her way out, got picked up by my band while on her way to Omega. Eight years old. She'd have had no chance on Horizon. I was trying to remember how many Cerberus operatives I've killed. Lost track around 50. Guess your elusive man's big on forgiveness. Maybe. I should let you go. Talk more later, Shepard. Hello. See you, mate. I think he just understands that you're good at your job. Right, let's check out the crew's quarters, see if anyone else has a mission for me. Hey, got a minute? Yeah. I'm not really sure what to do with myself. Not much call for thievery aboard a ship. Not a lot of people go in and out of Dr. Chakwa's office, other than to get medical attention, I mean. It seems like it'd be lonely, surrounded by people who never knew the ship you both served on. I'd be reaching for the brandy, too. Gabby and Ken would make a great couple. I just doubt they'll ever realize it. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. Okay, Kasumi. Let's check on Miranda first. 
Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't mm. like discussing personal matters, but this is important. Miranda, you're one of my crew. Tell me what's on your mind. You remember what I told you about Father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe, until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. So you think your father has tracked her down? Precisely, Commander. My sources indicate he knows that she's on Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. What do you know about your sister? She's my genetic twin. We're identical, but she deserves a normal life and she's going to get it no matter what. Does your sister's family know about this? Are they okay with being relocated? They know nothing. They're completely uninvolved. Normal. I told Cerberus and they're coming up with a positive reason to move the family. Okay. What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nurse Astra docking bay. Hey. Weren't you originally stationed on Horizon? Yes. If I hadn't joined Cerberus, I'd be abducted by the Collectors right now. Wow. You really dodged a bullet. Yeah, I couldn't take that. They creeped the hell out of me. Yeah, creep the hell out of me too. Hey, Garrus. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Fair enough. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. And I think that's it, except for um, Edie and Joker. So we're gonna talk to them, and then we'll head on to a mission. Loading times are so quick. Incoming message from Admiral Stephen Hack at Alliance HQ. Commander Shepard, I need to discuss a sensitive matter with you privately. I'll take this in my quarters. Ooh, okay. I wonder what Hackard could want. Dr. Kenson actually doing out there? She's a deep cover operative, Shepard. We talk only when we have to. I'd heard she was investigating a rumor of a Reaper artifact in the system. Her last report said she'd found it. What else can you tell me about the operative? Amanda's a top scientist and an Alliance agent working in a Batarian space. It's a deadly assignment, and she's one of the few up to the challenge. She and I go back pretty far, Commander. I won't let her rot away in a Batarian torture camp. I thought the Alliance denies the Reaper threat. That must be some proof she found. Kenson's team found an artifact out in Batarian space. She believes it's a Reaper device, proof that the Reapers are indeed planning to invade. I've known her a long time. If she says she has proof, it's worth checking out. The Batarians won't take kindly to the Alliance breaking into a secret prison. This is not an Alliance operation. It's one person going in alone to save a friend. If it were an official mission, of course the Batarians would be upset. You keep this quiet, Shepard, and there's nothing to worry about. Okay. I have a hell of a squad with me. I'm sure they'd help out. Kenson is my friend. If the Batarians see a squad of armed soldiers, they'll kill her. This is serious, Commander. Go in with discretion, or don't go at all. Okay. I'll make this a priority. 
The prison is hidden underground at a Batarian outpost on Arata. I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it. Hackett out. I really like Hackett. He's a good man. Go to Arata. Arata? Man, I love the load times on these bloody M.2s, they're crazy. I remember sitting there for ages waiting for that to load. Hang on the old Xbox 360. Hey, Joker. Hey, Commander. It's uh, pretty crazy the people you can run into out here, huh? I mean, it was probably a setup or something, but it was still good to see Ash, Operations Chief Williams, wasn't it? She moved on. I can't blame her. She was frontline with you blowing up half the Citadel, and I'm the one who gets roped back into saving the galaxy? But did somebody switch our files? You're the force that pulls it all together, Joker. Yeah, it sucks. I'll give you that. <laughs> I assume everything is going well up here? Shh. Joker? I can tell when it's listening. I am always listening, Mr. Moreau. I know. That's it for now. <laughs> See you, Commander. Oh, the chemistry those two have is so much fun. Right, let's check the terminal. Uh, Lion's shoulder gave me this information. He said you're trying to stop the collectors. They took my son and brother. Have you found them? Do you know where they are? Are they looking for people? Blah, blah, blah. We see Lions isn't doing anything. Council isn't doing anything. Gotta find people. Yeah, that sucks. Shadow Broker. Where your old friend Liara Tassoni is hunting the Shadow Broker for several years. We mind helping her hunt, given the Broken's past work for the Collectors. Yeah, okay. No Let's messages for you, Commander. Thank you. Speak to Liara. Let's leave the system, I guess. Actually, since this is a single system, I'm gonna 100% it. I'll be right back. All right, we're done with that. Let's see where we're going next. Oh, Jacob, Omega, recruit the Justicar, recruit the Assassin, give Liara intel. Let's sit down. We rescued Dr. Kenson. Well, we did say we would do that immediately. We still haven't done Project Overlord. So, hmm. Ooh. We've got Recruit Tali as well in the far room. We'll go do what the Alliance asked us to. I will 100% this and then do this one here. So I'll be back. One sec. All right. Now we are done getting all them. This is the only one we've got left to get the 100% on. And we will land. There. We're just auto level. Oh, yeah. I've got to go in solo. That's right. Oh, this will be fun. I don't ever remember doing this one either. Those water effects are looking a bit wet there, Shepard. It's not going to work. I wonder. What's across there anyway? This looks like a dead body. We've been spotted. Baron. The Batarians must send their prisoners down here to die. I have to find Dr. Kenson now. I can't jump down there. Why 
is my sensitivity so high? Oh my god. That's a bit better. Man, the atmosphere in here is creepy. This place is run down. Even for a prison. Huh. Freaked me out. Holy crap. Get your hands off me! Oh, that's her. We gotta get her. Must be another gas valve. Now the facility's all like fancy and shit. Hold on. We'll change out to a different weapon. I swear I saw something there. It's not. And holy crap, the atmosphere is just wild. Iridium, not that I needed any of that. This door, I guess. No way it would have worked. Relay can't be damaged, much less destroyed. Those humans will do anything for support, but swear, we have to make this one an example to the others. We can't respond kindly to terrorists. saw me. Anyone getting out of it? I don't know where the hell I'm going. Our calm buoy intercepts paid off. We picked up a message to the Alliance coming from somewhere in the asteroid belt. We listened to the feed until we discovered an operation run by a human named Kenson. Smuggling engine parts and guidance systems into the system from Omega. We intercepted Kenson's vessel and took her and her people into custody. Interrogation has produced nothing but frenzied rambling so far. Hmm. This one's apparently the mastermind. If she doesn't talk, kill her.
basis. No way we'll find it, even if we have to scan every asteroid out there. I wonder if those humans actually found something. Now torture is too great if it gets that information out of them. They wanted, so they wanted to kill the relay. So then... Reapers can't come? Who are you? What are you doing? Dr. Kenson, I'm Commander Shepard. I'm here to get you out. Commander Shepard? I'd heard you were alive. Hackett must have received my message. We're not safe here. Can you walk? I'm fine. Just give me a moment. We have to go. Now. If we can find a console, I can hack security. Make us an escape path. No, oh, the alarm's already oh, set off. Go. Ready. Yes, ma'am. Suppress the teams to cell block now. Oh, uh, they'll come from where we were. Hundred percent. Yep. We need to close the door we came in through. Keep them out. They're coming through that door in the back. Lock it down. They're coming up from below. Back we go. Back we go. Yep, going, going, going. Give me a sec. Two coming out. Righto. More enemies on the elevators. Which one? There's an elevator that leads up to the hangar. I'll bring it down to us. Almost done. See ya. One more, I'm guessing. Here we go, Doc. Is that it? I 
guess in the game didn't expect me to be that quick. Let's move. Or it's just a glitched out man in the ground. Fair enough. Get to the hangar. Do not let them escape. Oh, one last thing. The hangar doors are hard locked. We'll have to get those open the old fashioned way. Leave that to me. go. Jesus, man. <laughs> what the fuck? Engaging autopilot. We should be well out of range before they get their security measures unscrambled. Do you think they'll come after you? I'm not taking any chances. Batarians don't take kindly to humans who plan to destroy their mass relays. So the charges against you are true? Well, to be fair, that's about half the story. My people and I were here investigating rumors of Reaper technology out in the fringes of this system. I guess you found some. We found proof that the Reapers will be arriving in this system. When they get here, They'll use its mass relay to travel throughout the galaxy. We call it the Alpha Relay. From here, the Reapers can invade anywhere in the galaxy. Mm. So you decided to destroy it? I know about that. Doing that would stop the Reapers' invasion. Even at FTL speeds, it'd be months or years before they got to the next relay. We came up with what we just called the Project. A plan to launch a nearby asteroid into the relay and destroy it before the Reapers could arrive. Of course, the resulting explosion would probably wipe out the system. How did you plan to launch an asteroid into a mass relay? Moving an asteroid just requires thrust and guidance, which are readily available in Omega's salvage yards. Get the right amount of power and a good VI to drive it, and you can pretty much just point and shoot. Uh, I don't know about this lady. She's crazy. I've always heard that mass relays are indestructible. I've heard that too, but I think it's more that nobody's willing to find out what happens when one is destroyed. And, well, we plan to slam a small planet into the thing at very high speed. By our calculations, that's more than enough. Is the project still operational? I, I imagine it is. We were one button press away from launch when the Batarians arrested me. Why do you think destroying the mass relay would destroy the entire system? Mass relays are the most powerful mass effect engines in the known galaxy. The energy released from a relay's destruction would probably resemble a supernova. This is a remote system, but just over 300,000 Batarians live on the colony where they held us. The explosion would undoubtedly kill them all. How were you caught? We've been smuggling starship parts from Omega. Thrusters, guidance, an aftermarket ESO core. The Batarians thought that looked suspicious. A few days ago, I took a few of the men on a scouting trip, and the Batarians pounced on us. They never found our actual base. Mm. I still don't see how you learned about this supposed invasion. The evidence came from what we call Object Row, a Reaper artifact we discovered among the asteroids near the relay itself. When we get back to Arcturus Station, I'll explain everything and provide copies of all our notes on the artifact. What is a Reaper artifact doing on an asteroid? We don't know, or even what its purpose is. 
Some things are just too old or large to comprehend. Even I don't know about that, eh? Hey? He is dead contains power. Their artifacts are worthy of study, regardless of their purpose. Hmm. How exactly does a Reaper artifact give you proof of an impending invasion? It showed me visions of the Reaper's arrival. Much like your Prothean beacon, I imagine. The Reapers are coming, Commander. That much I know for certain. If you're working near a Reaper artifact, how have you avoided indoctrination? We've been very careful. We know what we're dealing with. You're not speaking to a child, Shepard. I saw what Sovereign did at the Citadel. Trust me, I know what's at stake. <laughs> you sure about that? <laughs> the stakes are too high. If you were willing to destroy a whole system over this, I want to see your proof. I guess I can't argue with that. Give me a moment. Kenson to Project Base. Affirmative. And I've got Commander Shepard with me. Tidy up the lab. The Commander needs to confirm the artifact. Yeah. All set. Sauce. Sit back and relax. We'll be there in no time. Very suspect. I don't ever remember doing this mission, ever. I must have never done it. Yeah, this all seems pretty suspect. Here we are. Welcome to Project Base. What's this? That's our countdown to arrival. When that gets to zero, the Reapers will have come. Just over two days and counting. Puts things in perspective, doesn't it? How do you know that's an accurate countdown? It is. The artifact has been giving off pulses at definite intervals since we found it. The intervals have been decreasing at a steady rate. The artifact is reacting to the Reaper's proximity. In just over 48 hours, the pulses will become constant, and the Reapers will be here. You're saying the Reapers could be at Earth in two days? There's no time to waste. Then let's show you that proof. That door exits the hangar. The artifact is in our central lab area. Yeah, we'll keep what we got. What's this? Anything else on the base out here? Nope. Ooh, power cells. Thank you. Go through the door at the end of that corridor to your left. So what would it take to get the project back up and running? Everything was in place when we were arrested. It wasn't a question of could we, but should we? What alternative do we have? The Reapers will reach this system regardless. But the Alpha Relay is their shortcut to the rest of the galaxy. If you want to keep the Reapers at bay, this relay must be destroyed. Ooh, is that it there? Oh, I don't know, being that close proximity to that thing constantly and you guys are probably all indoctrinated we have to get the project running again it's probably the only chance we have one sec let me get the door Commander Shepard, I give you Object Row. You have the Reaper artifact just sitting here? Out in the open? When we found it, it showed me a vision of the Reaper's arrival. Kenson, this is not good. Give it a moment, Shepard. It'll give you the proof you need. You start the project, Shepard. I can't let you stop the arrival. What?
take him down. They've seen us. Oh, what? What just happened? No. That dude came from nowhere. Take him to the med bay and patch him up. We want Shepard alive. But it could be a glitch in the system. No glitch. The sedatives aren't working. Security! Go, Shepard. Kick their ass. Stuck in here, right? The project is almost complete. I thought I'd feel a sense of accomplishment, but instead, I feel dread. I can't help but think we're doing something terrible. How do we get out of here? It's my gee. Shepard has been sedated constantly for two days now. We've had to increase each dosage. It seemed like Shepard was waking up a moment ago, but it could be a glitch in the system. No glitch. The sedatives aren't working. Geared up again. Good. Much time. I have to get this asteroid moving and get the hell out of here. Can't touch me through the window. Man, they just eat at my shield. There we go. Door's broken.
is this research log? I can see like a, a prompt for a research log. Where is it? There it was again, there. Oh, there, 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 there. She's acting strange lately. Like she doesn't care about the project anymore. I know I'm not the only one having those dreams. The Reapers are coming, she says. But I'm not sure if I'm hearing fear or hope in her voice. Hope. Just eat my health so easy. I need better armor. Another research log? Where? Element zero in the room. Let's keep going. Go, 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 go. Flamethrower, dangerous. Ouch, ouch. I'm not letting you get any closer. It's like a boss battle. Holy crap. Is that the controls? Alright, is there anything downstairs we can grab? Negative. I think that's it. That's it. Yep. Let's hit the button. I want to activate the project. Warning. Activating the project will result in an estimated 305,000 casualties. Do you want oh. to continue? I guess so. I'm gonna make the tough decisions. Go that way. No, not that. Give me this. Oh, it's got no ammo. Whoops.
Don't try to stop me, Shepard. I have to do this. I've already activated the project. We can still escape this rock. There is no escape. There's no redemption for what you've done. I will die, never having seen the Reaper's blessings. And you will just die. Damn it, kids. They've seen us. We go in, guns are blazing. long I'm not trapped. through this yep <clears throat> element zero thank you There's no ammo in this thing. Where'd the flamethrower dude go? Heavy left. No. Hopefully they drop some damn ammo. Oh, they did. Good. They just stun lock you. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> 
quick, quick, quick. We gotta get through this door. Good. Good. Yes, flush you. Oh, what a joke. Right at the door. Come on, man. You do me dirty like that. Yeah, we stopped the venting. Oh, we vented it. One or the other. Kill ya. Step away from the reactor. You've ruined everything. I can't hear the whispers anymore. Turn around. Now. You've taken them away from me. I will never see the Reaper's arrival. All you had to do was stay asleep. None of this had to happen. Kenson, you don't have to do this. We can get off this asteroid. No, we cannot. What an idiot. Just shows how bad indoctrination is, I guess. Joker, this is Shepard. I need a pickup. Now. Communication system damaged. Damn it. Evacuation protocols in effect. All personnel report to escape shuttles. Where can I find an escape shuttle? Take the lift from this room to the external access. From there, proceed to the communications tower. The remaining escape shuttles will be located on the tower's landing pad. I have to get to that comm tower and take a shuttle. It's my only chance. Man, we already beat like a an army. Who's gonna be left, bro? Now what's this? This is a cool room. Collect all the stuff before we're all doomed. Warning. Alpha relay collision imminent. Evacuation is recommended. Normalizing pressure in air mode. Oh, it was just like Here's all this free shit. Oh, look at the relay. Oh my god, my health just disappears. can I do to this mech? God. Where are you going? Oh. 
Shepard's a monster. He just killed everything. Oh my god, how close is that thing now? Oh! Get the hell out of here. We're actually getting closer. What? It is. Look, it's getting closer and closer. Oh my god. Where's the button? Where's the button? Where's the button? External comm channel open. Shepard to Normandy. Joker, do you read me? Oh, man. Shepard, you have become an annoyance. You fight against inevitability, dust struggling against cosmic winds. This seems a victory to you, a star system sacrificed. But even now, your greatest civilizations are doomed to fall. Your leaders will beg to be harvested. Maybe you're right. Maybe we can't win this. But we'll fight you regardless. Exactly. Just like, we did Sovereign. Just like I'm doing now. However insignificant we might be. We will fight. We will sacrifice. And we will find a way. That's what humans do. Know this as you die in vain. Your time will come. Your species will fall. Prepare yourselves for the arrival. Roger that. Yep. Good. I can't believe we're gonna kill all those Batarians though. Oh. It's crazy. Huh. Looks like you've recovered. Admiral Hack. Sounds like you went through hell down there. How are you feeling? Fine. No more visions, if that's what you mean. I wasn't expecting to see you here. You went out there as a favor to me. I decided to debrief you in person. That was before the mass relay exploded and destroyed an entire Batarian system. What the hell happened out there, Commander? Have you received any intel about what happened? All I know is I sent you out there to break Amanda Kenson out of prison. And now an entire system is destroyed. I hope you could fill in the leap of logic between those two events. I confirmed Dr. Kenson's proof. The Reapers were coming, and destroying that relay was the only way to stop them. Kenson sedated me for almost two days. I started the engines with little more than an hour left. I tried to warn the Batarian colony, but... time ran out. The Batarians report no survivors from our attack. At least you tried. Okay. And you believe the Reaper invasion really was a threat? Yep. No doubt about it. We literally had minutes to spare. I'm sure all the details are in your report. I won't lie to you, Shepard. The Batarians will want blood, and there's just enough evidence for a witch hunt. And we don't want war with the Batarians. 
Not with the collectors out there taking our colonists. What are you saying? You did what you did for the best of reasons, but there were more than 300,000 Batarians in that system. All dead. They died to save trillions of lives. If I could have saved them, you bet your ass I would have. You're preaching to the choir, Commander. If it were up to me, I'd give you a damn medal. Unfortunately, not everyone will see it that way. So what do you suggest? Evidence against you is shoddy at best. But at some point, you'll have to go to Earth and face the music. I can't stop it. But I can and will make them fight for it. I didn't expect to see you aboard a Cerberus vessel. I don't like Cerberus or the way they do things. But they brought you back to life, and they're actually doing something about the state of the galaxy. So for now, I can be friendly. I really like Hackett. I think he's good. Is the Alliance concerned about the Batarians' response to this incident? Very. The Batarians have been looking for an excuse to wage war on us since we showed up in the galaxy. If the Reapers invade, we need the galaxy to work together. If we're at war with the Batarians, the other races will be hesitant to give aid to either side. What's the Alliance doing about the Collectors? We're setting fleets around our major colonies and evacuating our smaller ones. But the ships that encountered the Collectors haven't reported back. We're outmatched. I'm really hoping you and Cerberus have an ace up your sleeve. I'll gladly stand trial once this mission is done. Glad to see working with Cerberus hasn't stripped away your sense of honor. Do whatever you have to do out here. But when Earth calls, you make sure you're there with your dress blues on, ready to take the hit. In the meantime, you keep this. I don't need to see a report to know you did the right thing. Yes, sir. You've done a hell of a thing, Commander. Yeah, you could say that. It's killed a lot of people. Man, that is insane. Wow. We did good, Jack I guess. Wants you, Jack wants to talk. Really? Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to talk to you. Horizon, what you did was amazing. The report mentioned that Ashley Williams was there. How did that go? It was good to see her. Do you have strong feelings for her? We had a job to do and we did it. I understand. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? Morden would like to speak with you over in his tech lab. Jack would like to see you down in her hidey hole on the engineering deck. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here if you need anything. You renegade, why? Um, we will do some research and then talk to those two, I guess. Maybe skin weave? Yes, please. No. Heavy bone weave? Yes, please. Maybe that'll help me from getting absolutely destroyed by those guns. Shepard, important news. No, you're busy. Have to deal with the collectors. Planning attack. Too important to wait. Just receiving data. Still processing, analyzing likely scenarios. Not sure how to begin. Too much intel. You remember our talk? My work on genophage modification? Uh, yeah. You stopped the Krogan adaptation to the genophage. Part of a team. Scientists, all different types. Blood pack mercenaries captured former team member. Malin, last seen on Tuchanka, might torture him, make an example. Recovering Malin would be a personal favor to me. Do you think they found out your team updated the genophage? Unclear. No way to determine until we get to Tuchanka. All right, we can do that. Go to Tuchanka and see if we can find your team member. Appreciate it. My assistant, my student, want to see him safe. Malin last seen outside Erdnot territory. Scouts might have seen Blood Pack. Talk to them or Clan Chief. Erdnot. Like Rex's last name? No, let's go see Jack. Jack, what are you doing? What do you want to talk about? Mate, mate, 
What are you doing? I got thoughts like little bugs crawling in and out of my head. I can't stop them. You know I have a history with Cerberus. You know how far back it goes? I'll listen to anything you have to say, Jack. Your pal, the elusive man? Never seen him before, but Cerberus raised me. First thing I remember is my cell door in a Cerberus base. They did experiments, drugged me, tortured me. Whatever chance I had to be normal, they stole it by trying to turn me into some superbiotic. The doctors, the other kids, every one of them hated me. They let me suffer. What did they hope to gain by torturing a little girl? It was something about pain breaking down mental barriers and how it might clear the way for a more biotic power. I'm sure there was a payoff due at some point, but I wasn't going to see it. I was wired up in a cell. They tortured you just to see if they could make a strong biotic? That's it? Wasn't in a position to ask, Shepard. All I know is a little girl crying in a cell. Begging for the pain to stop. You love the power they gave you. They never gave me a choice. That is true. How did you get out of there? There was some kind of emergency and I made a break for it. The other kids came out of their cells and attacked me. So did the guards. I just killed everything in my way and ran. Guess my biotics had developed faster than they thought. I managed to get a shuttle off the ground. Drifted until a freighter picked me up. The crew used me and sold me. That's my uplifting escape story. There were other children in the base? I didn't know much about them. I was kept separate. They hated me just like everyone else there. When I broke out, I had to fight through them all. I showed them. But there's a loose end I need to deal with. Okay. You're absolutely certain that Cerberus was running the facility? I was a kid, but I wasn't dumb. I know how to listen. It was Cerberus. Don't care how far down the chain it was. They thought they were so clever. Turns out, mess with someone's head enough and you can turn a scared kid into an all-powerful bitch. Fucking idiots. <laughs> I'm gonna talk to the elusive man, and he better have some answers. He'll just deny everything. That's not what I'm after anyway. I found the coordinates in your files. I want to go to the Telton facility on Pragya where they tortured and drugged me. I want to go to the center of the place, my cell. I want to deploy a big fucking bomb, and I want to watch from orbit when it goes. Attacking our allies is going to derail our mission. Not a smart move. The files say it was shut down after my escape. It's been abandoned for years. They going to care if I blow up a garbage dump? Guess not. You've lived with this your whole life. Why do this now? Like I said, I found the coordinates in your files. You can't expect me to just sit on information like that. I'll set a course for Pragya. I owe you, Shepard. Don't owe me shit. As you fight, we're good. Let's head back to the bridge. I wonder what Joker has to say about our um blowing up of that system. With Shaira in three months. I can't wait. We're flying into the eye of the storm, and you're thinking about some Asari prostitute? Hey, watch it. It's not like that at all. She's so. She's. You won't understand unless you meet her. Commander. I assume everything is going well up here? This thing wants to fire me over a joke. Okay, I said I'd flash the AI core, but I was kidding. And we'd only lose a few systems. Nosy ones. To clarify, Human resources adjustments are not actually under my authority. Then why? Why are you always picking on me? My replies were intended to provoke, though not to cause distress. Your reactions are atypical of most humans. You are interesting. She pushed your buttons to get a rise out of you. About time you were on the receiving end. <laughs> yeah, great. I just got worked by the intercom. It was not my intent to breed hostility, Mr. Moreau. But you did instigate our interaction. Okay, but... Think of it this way. Shut up. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Uh, those two are great. All right. Well, other than blowing up an entire system, that was pretty fun. But that is the end of this episode. And I will see all of you on the next one, where 
Hopefully we don't cause a giant blowy up thing like that. Oh my god, did you see that? I never noticed that that was all lit up. It actually shows you. So cool. Anyway, I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.